Man, Hollywood has always been Hollywood. It's complaining. It's, it's, it's just a, it's Hollywood, you know what I'm saying? It is what it is. Man, how, you know how many stories I got for I didn't put on and help and then he turn around and help the next man. Turn into groupies and all kind of shit. You know what I'm saying? They have a budget and give all the money to the they don't act like they ain't got nothing for you that's that's just how these be man but it's hollywood man hollywood so suge say look like jamie fox x or or roommate tyra turner in his feelings with somebody what's crazy is right shout out all the dialogue because he asked tyrant about this shit and, and, and i ain't gonna lie his response is a little strange Suge Knight, you know, a few months ago, you know, he posted a video of you on his verified Twitter. And, you know, he had a right. wild caption with it, man. He said that she was Jamie Foxx's ex. How you feel about him saying that, man? Yeah, come on, man. Like, first of all, I, I don't know. You know, I don't think me and Suge have, I thought we squashed it, whatever that was. So I'm thinking that's what it is. So, and then I heard earlier, you know, that uh, his, his thing was hacked or whatever his, his Twitter was hacked. So I give you, you know. If Suge wanted to talk to me, he he know how to contact me. He contacted me the last time we had an issue, an altercation. So he figured out how to get to me. So I'm sure he would, you know, I'm sure there's some kind of jail phone in there that kind of re could, you know, reach to me. Um, but yeah, he said something like that. So me and Jamie have been like, you know, brothers and best friends for like years. So what people don't understand is that we do a lot of business together. So you may have seen us a lot around, you know, we probably at the house. Brothers and best friend, he can't even. Hey, it's, he's stumbling over his words already. He's saying he can't even get the shit out. It's like P, we brothers, best friends. Which was it? Coming up with ideas and stuff like that. Actually, we got a television show called Alert. You know what I mean? That we that we created. You know what I mean? That actually will be um, airing March fifth on Tuesday. So you know how it go when you when you dealing with people. People want to throw the little. The, the gay rumor it's always some somebody always got to be gay in the world like but you know hey i know what I, I you know what i'm saying i know what i like so you feel me i i, I don't i wouldn't have thought that he would have that kind of you know situation because i'm like we in a different world like there's nothing wrong with being gay you know what i mean it's like cool like even even you know uh danny boy got a book he came out and, and said who he was you know now, now, what the hell Danny Boy got to do with you and Jamie Foxx, homie? Right? Hey, no disrespect to Jamie Foxx and that. I don't, you know, I don't know what's going on. But I do know it was a whole lot of stuttering in this, that, and the third in this goddamn segment, man. Oh, he wasn't ashamed of it. He, 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 um, you know, he, um, he just said what it was. So, and, and seeing that that was somebody that he, that, uh, Suge signed and they were like, that was like his, uh, his uh, his uh, I, I I guess son or whatever like I I don't know if he claimed him as his son or whatever but they were close so I would think that he wouldn't have a pro I, and maybe he didn't at the time Danny Boy didn't come out or whatever that was uh, about whatever his um sexual preference is you know Danny Boy is a friend of mine so this is no I, I love Danny Boy he's cool but he came out with a book and he came out and just kind of shared his what who he was so I would have never thought in a million years that Suge would would say that would put something out there like that or somebody being gay like that, especially in the time that we living in where it, it's okay. I had a, I had an uncle that was gay. You know what I'm saying? It's not. <laughs> Check this out, man. You acting like Meek Mill right now, fool. You understand me? This is the same shit Meek did. Just got the stuttering and, and just all going on and on and on about some other shit, brother. Answer the question, P. He say he trying to he trying to answer it, but he not really answering it though. And the cold part is that shirt ain't making this shit no better. Nothing wrong with it, so it, it's like it really corny. Yeah, they be doing the same thing with Dwayne Martin and Will. They be spreading that rumor, you know, saying that they be messing around. They was in a relationship, so you know, yeah. Yeah, I, yeah, I heard. Like I, I've never. I met. Look, I've, I've, I've met Will. Will has always been cool, chill. You know what I mean? I don't, I don't know the other side or whatever they think that or whatever the alleged things are. You know what I'm saying? I heard the, the little assistant dude come on and 
and say some something about some some you know anal situs you know whatever that anal stuff whatever that is like I don't I don't know I'm just saying I heard what the dude said but for me Will Smith ain't never like. Listen, I, I heard enough, man. Shout out Art of Dialogue. If you want to see the rest of that little clippy clip, right, go tap in. It's worth it. You know what I mean? You can come up with your own conclusion, right? And it's crazy. You know what somebody in the comments say? <laughs> somebody in the comments say, so you left the liquor store at 12 o'clock, right? Remember, and he starts stuttering and shit like, yeah, I, I think. And he say, you know you done fucked up, right? You know you done fucked up, right, T? And it's a trip, brother. Like, uh, it's crazy, bro. Somebody say this guy sound like he was doing something. You know what I mean? And he don't want to admit to it. Niggas talking about, I'm just going through the comments right now, right? Somebody's, <laughs> he trying to defend it. He gay. That's what niggas say. And it's crazy, right? It, it, it's, it's crazy that he throwing hella other niggas under the bus, right, with his allegations. That's the other thing. It, it's a trip. Like, you don't want to go down on a ship alone. He like, nigga, it's a whole gay boat. You understand me? We all on this motherfucker. <laughs> it is right. This is just a trip, bro, that you that you got to stuttering like that. And it's also a trip that you 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 if you say it's okay, right? You had a gay uncle and and all these other people is gay. Danny boy, gay, all these other people is gay. Why you don't just be like, fuck it, nigga, and stand on it. Cause niggas is gonna come up with their own conclusions, right? And they gonna bro, I ain't gonna lie, it's this clip ain't making it no better, bro. Like, with that shirt. That shirt was kind of, you know what I mean? But, shit, nigga. I don't know. Like, what y'all think? Y'all think Tyron is, is trying to, like, is he trying to, he don't want to stand on that shit, but he want to, it's like, you bring it up. When you get to bringing up one, a telltale sign of guilt a little bit, it's stuttering, for one. For two, is you throwing other nigga get to bringing other niggas up. Like, nigga, he did it too, and, ah, uh, it's like, bruh. What's up, nigga? That's, is, 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 stand on that shit, bro. If that's what you... It's crazy because he probably don't want to... You know, he probably ain't ready. You know what I'm saying? He probably ain't ready to jump out the, out the joint real quick. But no disrespect either, bro. I'm just, I'm just calling... Like, when I read the shit, when I see the, the uh, clip, I'm like, damn. And then you go to the comments, right? Your brain already come up with certain shit. Like, hold on. This shit look a little sus. Then... You go read the comments, the comments like, yeah, it's some such shit going on. Nigga, every, you know, like minds be coming, you know, niggas be having to come up with the same conclusion. Everybody ain't crazy, bro. But yeah, I don't know. Y'all niggas let me know what y'all think.